subscribe to this channel and also turn on your notification bell in order to get the latest updates. Who is no pity? This is the question everyone is asking about this English speaking warlord who has become famous thanks to the security crisis in the English speaking region for several years now. His real name is Mbashi Clement, but popularly known as General No Pity. He was born in 1994 in Bambalang, a village in the northwest region of Cameroon. No Pity, a former motorbike rider, turned into a warlord at the age of 28. He has been a thorn in the flesh of the Cameroonian army. He has been several times announced neutralized or dead. This Wednesday again, he made headlines by killing nine Cameroonian soldiers in a police post in noon. The majority of his attacks are filmed and published by himself. According to an article by Cameroon Web, it says, Never has a man done such damage to our Cameroon defense and security forces. A special force was even set up especially against him. But he did, he has been able to slip through the drops. Clement Bashi is a former student of Kas Bamli in the northwest region of Cameroon. As a teenager, he divided his time between the classroom and the family farm, where he was forced to work to pay his school fees. After an unsuccessful attempt at the GC ordinary level, he moved to Boya where he sold donuts and yogurt while taking evening classes in Musole. He decided to give up everything and join the rebellion because his employer shut down as a result of the ghost town following the Anglophone crisis. He tried his old motorbike business but later returned to the northwest where he learned combat and guerrilla techniques. He finally created the Marine Force of Bambalang a very dangerous rebel group operating in the northwest region. On July 31st, 2018, the mayor of Boya, Ekema Patrick, banned the circulation of motorbikes on the ground that they were regularly used by separatist fighters. The transport union mobilized and tried to convince the mayor to reconsider his decision. Among the carriers leaving the town hall that day, Mbashi Clement ruminates on his anger, frustrated, left Boya to return to his native northwest and opt for armed struggle. In 2020, he met himself the father of the Marine Forces of Bambalang in Gokutunja. He has made himself one of the most wanted Ambazonian fighters by the Cameroonian Armed Forces. In March 2020, it was falsely reported that General No Pity was killed in action near Bamali. In 2021, General No Pity has extended his reach and multiplied his attacks with his troops operating in Bambalang. Bui, Boyo and Mezam. In September of the same year, Gerano Piti and Bambalang Marine Forces cooperated with the Bamisin Jaguars to ambush a military convoy. The operation resulted in the death of 15 Cameroonian soldiers, the destruction of two armor vehicles, and the seizure of several weapons. No Piti celebrated that success by filming himself and his fighters next to the burning vehicles. That ambush drew national attention in Cameroon and led the government to step up its manhunt. In the month following the Bamin Singh attack, he called on the United Nations to take into account the Anglophone crisis in Cameroon in an audio message. At that time, he was described as the leader of the Ambazonian Revolutionary Guard by the Cameroon Intelligence Report. Meanwhile, the Cameroonian army launched operations to hunt him down which resulted in clashes that left several members of the Bam Bambalang Marine Forces dead. The armed forces once again claimed to have killed General no Piti before he resurfaced in Manyo. A few weeks later, the Cameroonian security forces arrested an impostor and bandit who had claimed to be no Piti. Eventually, they arrested Antoinette Kongso, who is believed to be the girlfriend or pregnant ex-girlfriend of General no Piti. The separatist activists reportedly arrested Von Yakum Kevin from Bambalang and demanded that Kongso and several of his imprisoned supporters be released in exchange for Kevin. Kongso was released on bail in December 2021. Over the time, Gerano Piti made more and more inroads into Bui, where he forced several minor separatist factions to unify into the Bui Unity Warriors. In cooperation with the Ambazonian Defense Forces ADF, he even managed to convince elements of the Bui Warriors, a rival group, to split off and join the Bui Unity Warriors. The unit that is officially led by General Maddock 
although there are no pity continues to act as the commander in chief. Under his leadership, the Bui Unity Warriors attack the Bui Warriors in April 2022, killing Fi Masha Ishobu. This operation was approved by the local population as Isobu had become infamous for abducting and mistreating civilians. On Wednesday, June 8, 2022, an incursion led by Gerano Piti and his men led to the death of nine Cameroonian soldiers, the destruction of Janameri post, vehicle and weapons seized.